There's only one little Phoebe baby left. Just sitting up there on the edge, chirping. I kind of think, well, McKenna discovered one laying down there yesterday. It was, it wasn't as far along as that one, because that one's got a decent amount of little bit of feathers on it. So, maybe, I don't know, but she didn't get it. I got it away from her, but um, the last time she had her, she did the nest over there, but it was, you know, that's done been a month ago, probably. And it wasn't as hot. I mean, it was hot, warmish, warmish, and it wasn't hot like it has been. I, I kind of, this my guess, and think that, uh, because in the morning the sun's on this side shining over here, but it's not in the sun. But, I mean, it's in the sun, but it's not in the sun. So the sun's shining on that roof. You know, it's got to be hot up underneath that soffit up there. Oops, sorry. So I kind of think they probably, and then I noticed the past few days they was doing a lot of squirming around up there because it was like hot. And I kind of figured maybe they squirming and fell out trying to, you know, they'd sit up there with little mouths open like we're hot, we're hot. So you see there, they've either kind of gotten too hot and died up there and they got kicked out. Or they squirmed around and fell out, but I just saw her take some food up there and there's definitely only one left up there. And I hope it don't fall out. But the other ones, the other bats she had over there on the other guy, they... They got big and they all sat there and I mean I was like dang y'all still hadn't left yet? That's how big they got. I kind of think that maybe they was too, probably too scared for well, you know dogs always out and me out here and one day they was all there and the next morning they was gone. I don't see it up there. What's it doing up there? It's up there scratching and stuff. It looks okay. But there's only one left. So hopefully it'll make it. Her the batch, all of them made it. There's no way they couldn't, cause they was all big, <laughs> full feathered, big old things sitting up there. But I think they just get. I think the other ones just get too hot, and they either you know, succumbed to the heat up there underneath the, up there and fell out, or they, and they, or they got, the mama bird picked them out, I don't know, or they just got kicked out, who knows, I just happened to notice, I thought, I thought yesterday, I was like, I think there's only one left, but definitely that's all there is now, so, she's tending to it, but I think she just picked a bad spot, I mean, it, good to get out of the rain but bad for heat so so here that not glad oh he is this one's got had this one got tall had a whole bunch of blooms and it's got four open and two left two left to open this one was a pretty color Mm -hmm. Only one oddball purple one, and so now we got this one, and this one, and then this is the last one to open. But I don't know, this one looks a little different. Same but different, I don't know, we'll see. It's kind of strappity looking. Maybe it might be different. Doesn't matter, because they're pretty no matter what. Those look like it's glowing, a little bit of sun on it. Well, I'm gonna get inside. I have to feed the feed the fur kids, and so oh, there's a mama bird. She she wants. I'm trying to take my kids some food, and you're bothering me. <laughs> All right, I'll talk to you next time. Bye bye.